become more available and more affordable for ourselves and our community. The idea began a year ago. A small group of friends became convinced that Hamilton needed better grocery options. After months of working with many of you, we are creating an alternative grocery store now in downtown Hamilton. Here are the problems. So many people want to eat more locally, produce food, but it's hard to find a wide selection of local grocery products in traditional retailers, or without doing tons of research and driving all over the countryside to different producers. We want it to eat better, more organic, more sustainably grown, more wholesome foods, but these types of products are often not local or they're sold at premium prices. We want to reduce our environmental impact, recognizing that our contemporary food system relies heavily on transportation, packaging, and other costly inputs. What we wanted was local products and ingredients at fair prices. Enter the food co-op. Now, some of you are already familiar with co-ops, uh, and in particular food co-ops, but Emma and I discovered the idea of food co-ops in Vermont, and we thought, this is what Hamilton needs. We've continued our research now and uh, with others through visits and conversations with over 30 co-ops across North America. Mustard Seed joins a long tradition of food enterprises offering a non-profit, full-service grocery store prioritizing local wholesome foods where you can be one of the owners. Co-ops, who is familiar with co-ops? Put up your hand if you've been a member of co-op, so maybe half of us. Um, big co-ops in this area, Mountain Equipment Co-op, of course, credit unions, daycares, some housing co-ops, but there are no grocery co-ops. Co-ops are member-owned businesses for member benefit, and this means that we can take collective action on our food options. We have an alternative to the big chains, and we can make our buying power count in our local economy. Will it work? Absolutely. You're here. You represent the foundation of grocery revolution in Hamilton. You're here tonight because you believe in taking personal, personal initiative for collective impact and benefit. And you're not alone. With over a thousand people responding to our online survey in one month, we knew that the interest was there. Over a thousand people are now part of this network on Facebook and Twitter. We've had over 60 people volunteering a lot of work in the last few months as part of our action teams. Uh, but there's lots more opportunities for many more of you. We project that 400 people will join this month, with 800 members joining by the time we open in spring 2013. Many members will go beyond their membership share and directly invest in the co-op to capitalize um, through promissory note loans. We expect annual sales to hit 1.5 million in our first year, with double-digit growth in the years following based on the experience of other food co-ops that we visited. So how can you make this happen? Well, you're here tonight and that's the first thing, so thank you. You can become a member owner of the co-op with a $100 investment, and many of you already have. Tonight is your first opportunity to become a founding member of the Mustard Seed Co-op. You can invest directly in the co-op as well through uh, promissory note loans and help us reach our $450,000 capitalization target through investments.